Hello everyone. Here we are going to continue with the exercise 15 of the chapter circle. We have already did till question number 4 in our previous video. Now let's see question number 5. Now here in question number 5 first part we are having this figure in which we have to find the value of x and y. So first of all we name it. So a, b, c and d. Now this O is the center of the circle. This means this AC is the diameter of this circle. और अगर AC diameter इस circle का, तो ये angle और ये angle, ये दोनों ही 90 degree के हो जाएंगे. Therefore, angle ABC equals to angle ADC equals to 90 degree as angle in a semicircle. Now, in triangle ABC, we can find out the value of X by using angles and property of triangle. Therefore, in triangle ABC, we are having angle ABC plus angle BAC plus angle BCA equals to 180 degree as angles and property of triangle and here we have a b c equals to 90 degree so we have 90 degree plus b a c is 32 degree so here we get 32 plus b c a is x so x and equals to 180 now this x will be equals to 180 degree minus the sum of these two that is equals to 1 2 2 and here we get x equals to 58 degree as the value of x now to get the value of y we are going to take the triangle a d c therefore in triangle a d c we have angle a d c plus angle d a c plus angle d c a equals to 180 degree as angle some property of triangle now angle a d c we have 90 degree so here is 90 degree plus d a c we are having y plus d c a we are having 50 so this is equals to 180 degree and y will be equals to 180 degree minus 140 degree and here we get y equals to 40 degree as the value of y hence answer now here we are having question number five second part in which we are having this figure now very first of all we are going to name it a b c and d now here we have been given that a b is parallel to c d अगर A, B, C, D के parallel है, this means this angle is alternate equal to this one. So, X will be equals to 37 degree as interior alternate angles. And to get the value of Y, we are going to get this angle as 90 degree. As this one is angle in a semicircle. Therefore, angle A, D, C equals to 90 degree as angle in a semicircle. Now, we know the value of this angle this we know so we can find out y by using angles and property of triangle so in triangle adc we have angle adc plus angle dac plus angle dca equals to 180 degree as angles and property of triangle now angle adc we have 90 degree plus angle dac is y plus angle dca is x equals to 180 degree x we know that is 37 degree so 90 plus y plus 37 degree equals to 180 so y equals to 180 degree minus the sum of these two that is 127 and this will be y equals to 53 degree as answer now let's see question of five third part here we are having this figure in which we have to find out the value of this x very first of all we are going to name this triangle so this is a b and c now here we are having o as the center of the circle therefore this ac will be taken as the diameter of the circle and as this ac is diameter therefore angle a b c will be 90 degree as angle in a semicircle so here we got angle a b c equals to 90 degree as angle in a semicircle now in triangle a b c we are having a b equals to b c as given to us now as the two sides of the triangle are equal therefore this angle will be equals to this one as angles opposite to equal sides so here we got angle bca equals to angle bac as angles opposite to equal side so we can consider this angle also as x so here we get angle bca equals to x now in triangle abc angle abc plus angle bac plus angle bca equals to 180 degree as angle some property of triangle now we have angle abc as 90 degree so 90 plus 
BAC we have X and DCA we have calculated as X and this is equals to 180 degree not 2x equals to 180 degree minus 90 degree that is equals to 90 degree only and x will be equals to 90 upon 2 so x we have got 45 degree as answer now here we are moving to the question of 5 fourth part in which we are having this figure and we have to find the value of this x very first of all we are going to name it that is a b c and d now we having this o is the center of the circle therefore this ac is the diameter of the circle and as this ac is diameter therefore this angle will be of 90 degree as angle in a semicircle so we have got angle abc equals to 90 degree as angle in a semicircle now we have been given with this angle that is angle a c d and this angle is exterior angle of this triangle so now we are going to use the exterior angle property of the triangle in which this angle will be equal to the sum of this and this one and here we get angle a c d equals to angle a b c plus angle b a c as exterior angle property of triangle now a c d we have 1 2 2 equals to a b c we have 90 degree plus b a c we are having x therefore x equals to 1 2 2 minus 90 degree that is x equals to 32 as answer now here we are having question of 5 fifth part in which we have been given with this figure and we have to find the value of x and y very first of all we will be naming it as a b c and d now o is the center of this circle therefore this ad is diameter of the circle and as AD is diameter, therefore this angle will be of 90 degree. So we have angle ACD equals to 90 degree as angle in a semicircle. Now triangle ACD, angle ACD plus angle CAD plus angle CDA equals to 180 degree as angle sum property of triangle. Now we are having ACD as 90 degree plus CAD we are having 40 plus angle CDA we are having X equals to 180 degree so x equals to 180 degree minus the sum of these two that is 130 and here we get x equals to 50 degree as the value of x then we have to find the value of y and we know this line is parallel to this one now as these lines are parallel therefore this angle and this angle are co-interior angle so we have x plus y equals to 180 degree as co-interior angles and here we have the value of x as 50 degree so 50 plus y equals to 180 degree and y will be equals to 180 degree minus 50 degree so y equals to 130 degree as answer now let's see question of 5 6 part here we are having this figure in which we have to find the value of x and y and we have been given that this side is equal to this one is equal to this one let's name it first so a b and c and here we are having d now very first of all we are going to entertain in triangle a b d so in triangle a b d this a b equals to b d given to us and as these two sides are equal therefore this angle will be equal to this one as angles opposite to equal sides and here we get angle BAD equals to angle BDA as angles opposite to equal side therefore this angle BAD will also be equals to X now we have this O as the center of this circle therefore this AD is diameter and this angle will become 90 degree as angle in a semicircle and we have angle ABD equals to 90 degree as angle in a semicircle now we can apply angle sum property to find the value of x and here we have angle abd plus angle bad plus angle bda equals to 180 degree as angle sum property of triangle now angle abd we have 90 degree plus bad we have x we have got over here then bda is x only given to us that is equals to 180 degree now 2x equals to 
180 degree minus 90 that is equals to 90 only and hence x equals to 90 upon 2 that is x equals to 45 degree. Now we will be coming in the triangle BDC and in triangle BDC we have been given that BD equals to CD and as these two sides are equal therefore this angle will be equals to this one and here we get angle DBC equals to angle DCB as angles opposite to equal side and we get angle DBC equals to Y. Then we are having this one angle as the exterior angle for this triangle. So by using exterior angle property for this triangle we have angle ADB equals to angle DCB plus angle DBC as exterior angle property of triangle. So angle ADB ADB we are having X that is equals to DCB DCB are, we are having Y and this DBC is also Y. Now we have got the value of X as 45 degree. So 45 degree equals to 2Y and that implies y equals to 45 upon 2. So y equals to 22 whole 1 by 2 degree. That's all for this video. Thank you.